Hello, I'm Murray Newlands with Search Engine Journal. Today I'm speaking with Mark from MediaWiz. He runs the SEO team. And in this video, we're looking at content marketing strategies for brands. And they've got a new white paper as to how you can use content marketing to optimize your SEO. So Mark, um, content marketing for brands, what are the things that they need to concentrate on? Thanks, Murray. So uh, when a brand is looking into content marketing, uh, the way, especially the way that we describe it in the white paper is a means to really diversify their website's link profile, especially you know given some of the more recent search engine updates, penguin refreshes, etc. Um, what we're finding is a lot of uh, brands that have been doing SEO over the years tend to fall into some very common trends, which will over time make their link profile look very unnatural. So basically what we're outlining in this white paper is how content marketing can be leveraged to best diversify that link profile and, and bring it back to a very natural state. And so what are the, some of those things that uh, you might see that they might have been doing and uh, how might content marketing actually be used to give me some specific examples for that? Absolutely. So, um, you know, very common is using over-optimized anchor text. So. Um, you know, over the years, a lot of brands have been actively building links to their websites, using you know money phrases as as the anchor text, target keywords, which you know it, it worked great a few years ago. Nowadays, you know, it's definitely not as effective, and even could be counterintuitive, um, you know, if if it's done at scale. So uh, that's one of the things to look out for is a high percentage of inbound links coming in using very targeted keyword anchor text. Uh, some other examples would be building uh, a very high percentage of links to sort of sales product uh, oriented pages, what we would consider money pages. Uh, these are not typically pages that other sites would link to naturally. So, um, you know, having a very high percentage of links pointing specifically just to the money pages is definitely a red flag and something that, that would need to be addressed. So these are some of the trends that you would, you would want to look for when analyzing a company's link profile. And the way content marketing comes into play is to actually start generating a more diverse um, sort of spread of where the links are pointing by creating new content, adding it to the site. And this is going to be content that's not so much sales oriented, but more to actually provide value to, to the consumers and to the target users. Uh, so what's going to happen is these are more likely to generate natural links, more highly authoritative sites that wouldn't necessarily naturally link to a money page, for example, would actually find value in these and you would actually get a link from sites that you may not have without doing the content marketing. Once you start to develop that kind of content, how as a brand do you get those sites to become aware of your content and to link to it? So there's a number of ways to promote the content. And it's really going to be customized depending on what the target audience is. And that's really one of the initial steps in creating a successful content marketing campaign is knowing very specifically who you're targeting with this specific piece of content and making sure that it gets in front of the influencers who would be very much interested in that content. So for example, um, you know, so you know, we talked about manually link building in the past using keyword targeted anchor text. Um, so there's still going to be some link building involved, but it's really uh, more of sort of a, a jump start to promoting this new content. So you want to do some, some link building to, to drive some links and drive some people to this new content. Um, there's also other things that you can do, such as, of course, social uh, promotion via social media and also content promotion. Uh, so for example, if you, you know, on some news sites, you'll get to the end of an article and it'll say, if you like this, you may like these articles. Uh, so that's another way to get people to that content that would be likely to engage with it and link to it. Fantastic. If people want to find out more and contact you, how do they do that? Um, so if uh, anyone wants to contact me personally, my email address is mpertel, M-P-U-R-T-E-L-L, at mediawiz.com. And I must have not been moving around enough. The lights went out on me. There we go. But and thank you, you very much. Follow uh, MediaWiz on Twitter at MediaWiz Inc. Or you can follow myself at Mark Pertel. Mark. 
Thank you very much. Have a great afternoon. I'm Murray Newlands with Search Engine Journal. I'll see you next time.